Okay, guys, for some reason, my recording stopped. Uh, but let's pick up where I left off. Uh, and this is locks. I don't know. There's like an alternative power supply or something. Can I go upstairs? I can. Corridor. Not a yeah, damn bedrooms, Jesus. Guess I have to get a four digit code. Oh, there's a safe. Okay. It leads me. So I guess this would be like the master's bedroom. Master bedroom. Is there like no fucking bathrooms? Oh, there's like. Oh, this might be the master bedroom. Uh, bedroom. Bucket shit, though. What's this? Ooh. A word square. I'm planning my retirement party for half a decade. He wants a youth movement inside the CIA. More creative and agile operatives, I recall saying. If he wasn't the one who framed me, he sure was eager to believe the pile of horseshit that landed on his desk. He can hunt me down as long as he wants. But he'd never think to look inside a former KGB safe house. Even if he knew it existed. So I guess this he was getting hunted. Go ahead in here. Case. Okay, so I'm thinking this boiler might have might be providing power to a hidden part of the house. We haven't found yet. Placed a black light upstairs if you want to do some investigation and New line fully opens the line. Oh. Okay. Easter egg. Uh, the boiler, the water can't start. What about, can we put fuel in now? What about if I pile it? And then put water in it. But does that open that door that I found? this way. Right. 
Or it does. We received word from D. He is stone. Okay. That door's locked. Is there anything this way? Why would I come down here? Okay. Oh, it's right here. Enter numbers to press and link key to test possible combinations. Toggle black light. Looks like they used one twice, so could be one. There's zero. Uh, no shit. Nope. Go back. One. Nine. Five. Zero. Four? I have to enter. Okay, so it is one, nine. That's not that, so let's try seven. I just typed nine so many times, oops. So one, nine is correct. Five isn't. Seven. Four is next for sure. And then let's try one again. Well, we know the code now. We just have to fucking arrange the numbers. So, it is one, nine, let's do four. One, seven. Oh, we got it. After the incident, when we are moving to a new, more secure system down here, moving to the or this and so will only be granted V the terminal in the mainframe room. Apologies for the inconvenience. Decode cryptor. The fuck? Or... Oh, that's cool. E three would be E and then two would be N, right? Yep, open. Five six B U twenty nine. That just happened to be spell bunker. H. So two L. Nine is B. Nine is D. Zero is seven. Oh, 
a zero or no seven. Zero is I. Holding. Open bunker holding. So N G. Eight is R holding two two zero zero or O O and nine is M room open bunker holding room. I guess that opens one of these doors. Not that one. Does it open this door? It does. That bastard swallowed the key. Get it out of him by any means necessary. I do not care if he is unable to speak for a week. What the fuck am I playing? Fallout? Grab the key. So it does have that key to open the other door. It is. And there's numbers. What the fuck? Five. Eight. Two, one, six, five, four there. What the fuck? I will be the first to open the safe and claim the prize. Oh, is this the fucking... Oh, this gives you the save. Did it repeat? Iron. I'm just gonna assume iron is four. Curtain is nine. Or nine. Three. And I think there was a box of cereal over here, right? So seven. So could the code be four nine three seven? 
Go find out. Ooh. Oh, wrong way. So, it was upstairs in that room, I think, right? Yes, it was. So, four, nine, three, seven. Guess not. Wrong word. Oh wait, curtain is zero, so it might be four zero three seven. But where's the iron? And if there's someone with the iron on the windowsill, the curtain got fire. The American didn't notice. He was too busy watching cartoons on television while eating sugar coated cereal. I don't see the iron anywhere, so I So I'm just going to assume it's four zero three seven. I feel like I'm doing an Easter egg. Okay, let's try this again. The so four zero. Oh, yeah, it was. Complete all safe house campaign puzzles. Safe cracker. Money can be used in a safe house to acquire new abilities. Ooh. What's our objective anyway? Speak to Woods. What's going on, man? Just what we found in Atlas Files. An assassin, maybe 30 years old, came from one of Avalon's crime factions, the Guild. Fear she was raised through the Guild and then exiled, left, don't know. Whatever it is, Adler was interested, so I am too. So far, we've got nothing but Adler's homework. But he could be out of his mind. Whether he is or whether he is of those paramilitaries in Kuwait, they were the real deal. Well armed, coordinated, and motivated. Do you believe I'm there? Hell, man, I don't know. Seems hard to believe, but maybe I'm just naive. If Livingston's involved, he could have wanted added off the board one way or the other. Okay. You got it. Now, where the fuck is Woods? Oh. <sighs> All right. What kind of life savings you got? That a boy. Garpe fucking deal. Well, guess what? If we're really doing this, we gotta get financially creative. This place might have been fine for Adler, but for a team, I'm thinking overhaul, an armory, place to train, gear bench, not to mention anything else we might end up needing. Thursday won't be free, though. 
Marshall found a few grand stashed in one of the rooms upstairs. Other than that, we're starting fresh. No touching our own bank accounts either. Someone will be watching. When you're on a mission, look around for any cash lying around. If you're gonna Robin Hood your way through this, steal from the rich and give to the poor. That's me. We were following an old KGB trail and a single recording led us here. Seemed abandoned. When we asked our mole inside the KGB about it, he knew nothing. Belikov thought maybe it was some kind of splinter group, not sanctioned by the Central Committee. Whatever it was, it doesn't look like a red stepped foot in here since 1968. Yeah, I don't think he wanted to get others involved. Looks like he was working on a trust list. As far as I could tell, he didn't contact anyone. That's probably why Adler was talking to Dumas, keeping it outside of Langley. We're gonna do the same, at least for now. The board behind me is how we'll track our spending. Give it a look. Just tell me where you want to spend the cash and I'll set it up. I guess let's just build them all. Or does it, do I have to use money to get weapons? So first, let me go find out. Yeah. Fucking knew it. Three thousand cash for a blueprint. Like Marshall said, your mission details are on the board over there. And then let's launch them. I shouldn't leave much intel on Savati Dumas, but I can tell you a thing or two about Avalon. It's a playground for the filthy rich, and crime factions run the whole city. Everyone's looking for who to push it off the slide. When they pick a target, they hire someone like Savati. She used to be part of the guild, one of the most powerful Avalon factions, but now she freelances. Savati said that Adler hired her to follow a Pantheon trail, so you're gonna join her on that job tonight. We wanna see firsthand where that trail leads. Maybe we'll even add some muscle to the team. You'll scratch her back, and sure as hell watch your own. Trust is gonna be earned. Hello, Case. Check under the phone booth. I don't want to look under the phone booth. Need to... Need to grab buy something later, so I can put that there. His name is Yannick, a broker for the guild. He'll be on his yacht tonight taking a call with the Pantheon. We'll be listening in. Once that call is finished, you'll finish Yannick. That'll draw the target I really want. But first things first. 
The bell tower on that church offers an open view of Yannick's yacht. He's throwing a party while his men count money in the church. Yannick traffics in weapons, narcotics, women, whatever pays. Rumor has it the Pantheon wants a relationship with the guild, so Yannick is testing the waters. He's only our first domino. The real fun starts after we knock him down and get access to the target I really want, Johannes Edi. Close enough to know if you screw this up. Let's see what you're made of, Case. Get to the bell tower. I don't care how. Quiet, loud, just get there. Good hands. You could go for a swim, avoid some guards. Why is my interface all fucked? You can pick a lock. Once we listen to Yannick's call and confirm a Pantheon lead for Adler, I'm declaring open season on the guild. They have it coming. I should know. I used to work for them. I never cared for Yannick's parties when I was with the guild. Though they were good practice in how to blend into a scene. Any girl who caught the other side was in for a long night. So let's cut his short. Yannick does it right. Both drugs, both girls, worse music. Access to the bell tower is on the second floor behind the locked door. I get over there. They won't go all night. Get to that bell tower. Shut up, damn. Not damn thing. Sounds like there's a pile of cash near the altar. Pantheon's down payment to the guild. Yannick's expecting a call from Pantheon any minute. Guards are close. Do it quick. This morning I stashed the rifle at the top of the tower. Remember, Case. Don't pull the trigger until we hear his call. We need to confirm any connection to Pantheon. Oh, there's cash over there. I kind of want to grab it. Get 
pick up their cheese. Party won't go all night. Get to that bell tower. They won't go all night. Get to that bell tower. Yannick's near the umbrella. Upper deck, left side. Surrounded by girls. <sighs> Got your advance. My boys are still counting it. It's all there. Remember! This deal is one and done, huh? Don't need to get mixed up with the CIA. Oh, your pantheon thing. You'll send the hardware tonight, understand? That's not what we agreed to. Tonight, Yannick. Don't test me. So the pantheon and the CIA are connected somehow. We got what we need. Take the shot. Good shot. Yannick was just our first domino. We have more work to do tonight. Head back towards the payphone. I'll pull up in a white van. Guards inbound. Word on Yannick got out. Get past the canal. Well, he did, you dumb motherfuckers. You're in the clear case. <laughs> Let's go, case. That's Gabriel up there. He's cool. Okay. I don't like that. an emergency meeting at Chateau de la Haute Lune. Three guild leaders will be in attendance to smooth things over with Pantheon. I want to get paid, so we're going to crash that party. Chateau de la Haute Lune. Let's go. The guild will lock the restaurant down and meet in a safe room on the second floor. The door can only be unlocked from the inside. You're gonna help me get that door open. We're a few minutes out yet. Just enough time to get changed. There we are. Fits for guild security. Personally, I want these guild bastards dead. Pantheon's the icing on the cake for me. This is my stop. Get to the safe room's antechamber on the second floor. An alarm will go off. That's okay. The guild doesn't know you. So your best option is to surrender and play along. When you get inside, wait for my cue.
Thank you.